close everything soon unless the numbers will go down but yesterday we had almost 20,000 people infected and we do a lot of swaps more than before so the situation is quite serious again but uh, we will see guys uh, we will see at least uh, uh, last week uh, in uh, in the red cross um i've i've i have to do my exam as a volunteer because i will start to be a volunteer i now i work in the office uh, what you what is your opinion when we will be and i don't know i really don't know stay strong italy yes thank you and help from the government they did what what they could in the past now they are trying to understand how to help because uh you know if they close our high mexico bienvenido if they close again to help it's very difficult we need uh, you know other monies so many people will not follow regulation with create risk for everyone exactly that's another problem for example i i know it's difficult for a millennial for a young for a teenager but uh, you know we had a lot of teenager without masks uh, and uh, you know i have to i have to find the vaccine yeah if you find it please share it because in the surge in new cases we don't know pandemic controller it's difficult how you can it's uh, it nothing is under control now it's so difficult you know there's covid everywhere wherever you go you find people asymptomatic there are no enough swaps everyone has it we don't know if it's uh, you know if it goes through the air we don't know if if it how how much how long it stays on the on the buttons on the handles we don't know anything some here in london lots of people not even wearing masks this is crazy the masks protect protects other people from you if we all wear masks we all are protected if you are if you are weak for a reason if your immune system is down you need to wear the n90 or ppff um, ppf3 this is just to protect uh, other from you from your droplets but we if we all wear masks at least it's something you know here for us it's mandatory we cannot be out without masks guys vaccine it's uh, it's only mag imagination i don't know you know the the uh, who, who who comes out with the vaccine is going to be rich for sure for sure this is a big business guys the mask is a tax on oxygen but at least you know your droplets stay with you and it doesn't go out it's true it's pandemic it is it's everywhere you know uh, I have my sister with the COVID so what I have to say it's a reality why they always delay the cure maybe stay safe goodbye thank you for being here has got to get used to the masks yeah yeah China you know, um, we have a lot of, um, we have a Chinatown here, which is very close to my house, and uh, a lot of uh, Chinese. And when the COVID came to Italy around March, uh, the Chinese people disappeared. Everything was shut down, every shop, everything, nails and uh, hair, boom, closed. And they uh, stayed, it, in, in home you know the, the, the kids didn't go to school anymore and uh, and we didn't have one single Chinese uh, affected with COVID in Milano uh, for, during the pandemic they they know how to behave I mean uh, if their government says uh, don't go out stay home they stay home that's for sure it's they are not like us for us if they say don't don't go out we go like pa -pa -pa -pa, parties it's difficult for us i mean we are different but uh, ooh. 
they are very virus educated they are for sure more than us <laughs> they are we didn't have any problem here they taught us how to behave and they were very kind and they send us a lot of masks and uh, you know hello hi welcome I am walking in the in a Europeans like freedom a lot it's true you know almost ready for the lockdown <laughs> I guess the first thing I will do as soon as this uh, nightmare will stop uh, it, it will be to travel to buy a ticket Buenas tardes desde España hola bienvenido en Milano American love freedom the most the most yeah we all love freedom and traveling and uh, you know going out uh, having fun I think so you know it's very difficult for the economy but travel to eh, I miss Paris I miss Paris a lot hi from Chicago Illinois welcome it's a mo my monument of a feat. <laughs> People had a hard time getting used to seat belts in the beginning. Safety first. You're right. Also, when the, the um, cigarettes comes out the law, you couldn't smoke in the um, public places. Your sister get be better. Thanks for sharing. Thank you very much. Thank you. Hi from Italy. It was a feat. I know it's a little bit uh, sometimes. Uh, I did show this feat during, a, during my scopes. There is a feat. It's a, a British artist. And here the hand. Hand and feet. <sighs> yes. Little bit weird, huh? British artist. So, guys, uh, in this, uh, it is my feet, and I left when I traveled to Milano. You leave it here, you left it here. <laughs> it's so. Where do you buy your shoes? <laughs> made of bricks I mean looks like bricks but I'm not sure what is it <laughs> it's a big foot you see if you go if you watch around there are just uh, big food locker yes <laughs> I guess so just um, just teenagers just uh, young guys I, I guess it's hard for them. It's uh, you know, stay home. They don't understand. They 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 have they they will think, I'm you know, I was uh, born in a very weird period. My grand grandparents had the war, the real war with bombs and, and we have the COVID. I don't know. Which one is better? Maybe this one, for sure. But... Reservoir up! Hello! Welcome to Milano! In a... Club... Saturday. Getting ready for the lockdown. But not yet lock on lockdown. <laughs> <laughs> 